Yo, before I get into a video, I want to give a quick shout out to Blood and Supernova for bringing up this topic, and which I'm going to be discussing right now. They both made a video in their channel, so go check out the description. Their channel and the video that they made about this topic will both be in the description. Subscribe to them, show them some love, and let's get right into the video. So what's wrong with the DA2 community? Holy shit, there's so many fucking things. So if you have seen one of Bloods or Supernova's videos that I showed you in the video, in the beginning of the video, you'll pretty much be hearing almost the same thing, but a little bit of different things in my opinions. So first of all, it's the players, the pros that think they're all that. They're always going to come up with excuses. Not going to lie, I've done it before. But now I'm starting to even, I don't even give a fuck that much anymore to even care because this is if you realize if you think about it this is a game on your phone this is a mobile game it's nothing too big to cry about no oh i'm rusty no oh it's the first day of first game of the day no bullshit even if it's your first first game of the day that don't mean shit you're gonna be playing your same fucking playstyle that you always play, whether if it's camping, whether if it's your rusher, whichever it is, there is no excuses. If you have a broken arm and you can prove it, well, yeah, that's an excuse. But shit, nobody's gonna believe you. Oh, okay, you're rusty. You haven't played in what, three months? You're back? Okay. Maybe you are, you just need to play like a couple games, one or two, you should be fine. Same thing goes for me, I say that I'm rusty, yes. That's because I'm still trying to figure out these controls, my nigga, <laughs> come on. Second of all, the first one was excuses. Second of all, r the racism, oh, holy shit, we have so many Trumps in here. Nah, but on the real, I don't care if you're black. I don't care if you're an Indian. I don't care if you're Australian. I don't care if you're from Russia. I don't give a fuck. You're just another player in this game. It doesn't have to do with anything. A lot of pros hate on Indians. A lot of people even think that if you're a droid, you're automatically an Indian. What? <laughs> Nigga, what? That's not all true. If you're Indian, who cares? You're just another player. There are Indians that are good. There's Indians that are bad. Don't nobody give a fuck. We need to stop that shit. Honestly. And a lot of people always talk shit about them. Or they'll be commenting on uh, black people. Shout out to Viper, but this, it needs to stop, honestly. Third of all, being banned. If you get banned, like this happened to me a lot before, I'll open up a lobby and it'll be meant for someone. If I want to, for example, if I want a 1v1 fade, shout out to fade too. If I want a 1v1 fade, I'm just looking to 1v1 him. I don't want to play no other players. If you get banned, that's the reason why. Maybe we just want to play with other players. We don't want to waste time on other people. We hardly even have time to make time for this game. A lot of people have school. A lot of people have jobs. Don't matter. We barely make enough time for this game think that we're gonna waste that time that very little time that we have on other people that we don't want to play with no the fuck we want to be playing with the people that we invited that's the reason we open up the lobbies there's no need to like throw a fit and start going on kick automatically and say oh why you kick me why you ban me do you hate me there's no reason for that if i ban you don't throw a fit don't don't start crying. 
It's just a game. Play with someone else. Play with other friends. Don't you have friends? Yes, you do. Of course you do. Um. So yeah, this DA2 community is honestly kind of shit. There's always trash talkers. There's always, oh, if you don't want to face me, then you're scared. And they start trash talking and all this other shit. If I don't want to play you, or if anyone else doesn't want to play you, they just don't have time. You got to understand this. This is just a game. I love making DA2 videos because it, this is the only game that I enjoy on my on my phone. The only game that I can actually make video on right now. And I know that you guys enjoy some of it. Anyways, another thing that I really want to talk about is people that take screenshots when they win one match out of like six or seven that they lost. Just to prove to everyone in the community that they beat a certain player. Say that I face someone and they they haven't beat me or they're no match for me. And I'm just playing for fun. I'm testing something or I'm just like screwing around, you know, like using the knife or the shield or whatever. I'm just playing around. And they actually won one game, say, by, like, one point. And they take a screenshot. And they don't tell you anything. They're like, oh, okay, well, I have to go now. And then they instantly go on kick, tell their friends, and then their friends end up telling the other friends, a group chat or whatever. One of my friends starts telling me, like, hey, did this kid beat you? Or, or whatever. And I'll be like, no, you know? So, they take screenshots just to prove. If they're a known world player, like, like, uh, Viper, like me, uh, Hydro, Laser, any one of those well-known players around the DA2 community, including me, of course they're going to take screenshots just to prove that they're, they're better. And just because we're well-known... Someone else is easily going to be able to tell who that is. And they're going to be like, oh, that guy's pretty good. Or, oh, that guy's a legend. Or whatever, you know. They're going to end up taking a screenshot just and keep it just to prove that if someone else, like, oh, have you heard of this guy named Pyro HD? He, they'll be like, yeah, I wrecked them or whatever. And it's by one point. What's the reason of you to take a screenshot? There's no... T There's honestly no point. It's just... You're just taking up storage. If you really want to prove that you're better than someone else, then prove it just by beating them. You don't need to take screenshots. There is actually no point. Just play the damn game and prove... That you're actually better just by your skills. So I got on kick the other day and saw this picture. No hate towards this player. I just thought it was pretty funny. But this is one player that, you know, takes a lot of screenshots and probably does have every DA2 player that's well known with screenshots. No hate again. I'm just saying... But just don't be like this guy right here, this player. But anyways, I honestly hope that the DA2 community gets better along with the game. And there could be no more discrimination and hate towards other players like Indians that play most. That's mostly part of this game. That's that's a huge part of this game. And we can't give them hate or anything. So I hope, I honestly hope that this community gets better. Even though it's a really small community, nothing too big. But this is why mostly people quit too. So I'm just hoping it can get better and then everyone can be happy just playing this damn game. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry for my 
for my nasty ass voice but if you actually want to hear more of it during like live commentaries on while i record or just want to hear my voice more often in more videos more future videos let me know in the comments and i hope y'all guys enjoy this video peace